we've got a couple things going on. First of all, we have the first chord, we have um, second string, first fret, and then with our right hand, we're, we're plucking the fifth string and the second string. So the fifth string's open. And it's just those two notes. So fifth string and second string, and then the second string alone at the third fret. So let's piece those two together. We have second string, third fret, and then after that, we have open sixth string and open second string. So let's tie that all together. We have and then second strings, first fret alone. And then this last chord. Point your finger on the sixth string, first fret, ring finger on the second fret, third string. And we're gonna pluck those together, uh, sixth string and third string. So again, from the top, we've got fifth and second string, first fret on the second string, third fret, second string, open six and open two, and then first fret, second string, and then first fret, sixth string, second fret, third string. And now, where it's fun is they use a capo. So when we do get a capo, put the capo on that first fret, and now the way it's gonna work is this fret doesn't really exist anymore. This is our new first fret. So you play that exam exact same sequence Up, and that's the beautiful part about the capo. You could go up here, 